Hello everyone! This video demonstrates the performance of a simple position controller for differential drive mobile robots. The goal of the control algorithm is to move the robot from the starting point, shown over here, to the target point, shown over here. This is achieved by using two controllers. The first controller controls the orientation of the robot or the direction of the velocity vector and the second controller controls the velocity intensity. This animation is generated by simulating the control algorithms and robot motion in Python. The simulation is obtained by integrating the kinematics equations of the robot motion. The simulation is visualized by using Pygame. Links to the control algorithm and simulation tutorials are given in the description below this video. To illustrate the controller behavior, we consider three cases. In the first case that you're currently watching, both orientation and velocity control gains are low. We can see that the trajectory from the start point to the target point is not straight. That is, the robot does not follow the shortest path. The control error in the x and y directions is shown over here. We can see that after initial overshoot, the control error will decrease and eventually this robot will reach its destination. However, the path is not the shortest path and this is the drawback of this case. In the second case that you're currently watching, the orientation control gain is high and the velocity control gain is low. We can see that the robot follows more or less straight trajectory to the target. Initially, the orientation controller adjusts the orientation by simply rotating the robot in the proper direction. Then it follows the straight path. Over here, again, we can observe what happens. Initially, the orientation controller will adjust the direction and after that the robot will just follow a straight line. However, over here we can observe that the motion is relatively slow. We would like to increase the gain of the velocity controller such that we have faster motion. Let's do that. In the third case that you're currently watching, both the orientation control gain and the velocity control gain are high. We can observe that the robot slightly deviates from the shortest path, however, the response is much faster, and we can see that we reach the target in a relatively short time interval. Perfect. If you want to learn how to implement this basic controller and how to simulate and animate system behavior in Python, you can study the tutorials whose links are given in the description below. Also, there is a link to Python code files. That would be all for today. I hope that you liked this video. If you like the videos I'm creating, please press the like and subscribe buttons. Thanks a lot and have a nice day.